Hello guys, welcome back to my another After Effects tutorial, in this After Effects tutorial, we are going to create this. Here you can see, I have already created the lightning cloud composition, and also, I have imported the background clouds file, which we are going to use in the project. Now without any wait, let's start creating the lightning animation. Create a new solid. Name it as lightning. We will create lightning effect on this solid layer. In effects and preset, search for advanced lightning. Add it to solid layer. As we are creating this effect for clouds, we will set the lightning type to Omni. Here we need to set the origin of the lightning, so let's set it to the center. Perfect. Here you can set the length of the lightning you want. Now let's animate this lightning effect. At start of the timeline, Create keyframe for conductivity state. At end of the timeline, here you are free to set conductivity state value. Here I will set it to 40. You can see the preview. Perfect. In core setting, let's set core color. Here I will set the core color to red. In glow setting, Change Glow Opacity to 0%. Let's set Turbulence to 0.90. In Expert setting, change Core Drain to 60%. You can see the preview. Now in Effects and Preset, search for Solid Composite, add it to the solid layer. Change color to black. This will remove the transparent property of this layer. Now let's create duplicate of the layer. Press Ctrl plus D to create duplicate. For this layer, we need to change mode to add. Press U to view created keyframe. To make two different lightning, we will make few changes to this lightning effect. Let's change start keyframe value for conductivity, change it to 5. For end keyframe, change it to 20. For this lightning, let's change the core color. Here we will set it to blue. Here we will make few more changes, set forking value to 100%. Decaying value to 0.45. In expert setting, change fork variation to 70%. Now let's change the minimum fork distance value. Here I will set it to near about 240. Now you can see the preview. Now select both layers, pre-compose them. Name it as lightning. For this lightning composition, in effects and preset, Search for fast box blur. Add it to lightning composition. Now search for exposure. Add it to the composition. Set exposure to 11. Now let's adjust the blur radius. Here I will set it to near about 200. You can see the preview. In Effects and Preset, search for CC Composite. Add it to the composition. Change Composite to Add. We will again add the Box Blur effect. Set Blur Radius to 20. 
Now again add exposure. Set exposure to 3. Now add CC composite. Change composite to add. Now again add fast blur box. Set blur radius to 7. Here instead of creating multiple compositions, we have added all the effects to the single layer. You can also create individual composition and add these effects, the result will be the same. Now let's add the background clouds video file to timeline. Download link for this video is provided in the description. We will hide this layer. For lightning composition, in effects and preset, search for set matte, add it to lightning composition. Here, change track matte to background clouds. Change matte to luminance. Select invert matte. Now let's see the preview from the start. Perfect. Now we will create a new adjustment layer. For this adjustment layer, in effects and preset, search for glow. Add it to the adjustment layer. Set glow intensity to 0.03. Set glow radius to 300. Now let's create a new solid layer. Name it as noise. Find noise layer, in effects and preset, search for fractal noise. Add it to noise layer. For this noise layer, we will create mask, select the rectangle tool. Create mask as shown. For mask layer, set feather value to 300. Perfect. For fractal noise, set brightness to, minus 30. Set contrast to, 150. Set complexity to, 20. In transform, increase scale value to near about 200. Make sure you are at the start, now create keyframe for offset turbulent. At end of the timeline, change offset value for x-axis as shown. Perfect. Now at start, create keyframe for evolution. At end of the timeline, change evolution to 1. Now for noise layer, in effects and preset, search for tint. Add it to solid layer. Here I will change map white color to, blue. Perfect. Fine noise layer, change mode to screen. Now press T to bring up opacity, set opacity to 10%. Now let's see the preview. Perfect. Here our lightning clouds are created. Thank you guys for watching this tutorial. If you like this tutorial, then make sure to like and share this video, and also subscribe to my channel. Thank you.